imagine having your house burned by enemy forces and being turned out into the cold and it's nighttime. It's about what it must have been like to be turned out into the cold in this massive wilderness. No hotels to go to, no friends to stay with, nothing but cold and wind. But to me, what's most remarkable is what happened after the village of Buffalo was burned. Across the world, Mount Tambora exploded a year later, sending a layer of ash and dust clear around the world, reflecting the heat from the sun back out into space. And that resulted in snow during the summertime. And there were accounts of 20 inches of snow in Vermont in August. In Western New York, in this area here, people were running out of grain supplies. The fact is, no one really knows how many people died exactly from the burning of Buffalo after the village was burned of hypothermia and starvation. And with the explosion of Mount Tambora, they were faced with a double whammy. And that's a piece of history that should not be forgotten.